Good afternoon. It's a tale of two halves the weather today, so I thought I'd start with the sunnier half of the picture. That's across Scotland and Northern Ireland. This was sent in earlier in the day from East Lothian. However, it's not at all plain sailing either because we do have some big showers around in the north, whilst in the south we've got a low pressure system and widespread cloud across England and Wales. And that cloudy, damp weather even quite wet weather will continue well into this evening, spray and standing water on the roads. However, any thundery showers in the north and the east of Scotland in particular should fade away overnight. So under clear skies, it's going to be a colder night. Temperatures even in Glasgow and Edinburgh will be close to freezing, so there'll be some frost in the glens, contrasting with a rather murky, misty night in the south, but still relatively mild. Now for the weekend, clearly we've still got that cloud around to start with some rain, but it gets brighter, there'll be some showers around, it'll feel, I think, a little cooler just because of the wind direction, we're pulling in a bit of a northeasterly. Quite a strong wind actually in southern areas to start the day on Saturday and still that low pressure's meandering around across northern and eastern parts of England, so a lot of cloud around here to start the day and showers further north. So again, not the best start to our weekend, unfortunately, and even into the afternoon you can see that cloud is here turning more showery. There could be some sharper bursts within it. More sunshine I feel further north, northern England, northern Ireland and Scotland. But again, there'll be a scattering of showers. They could be quite sharp, a little bit of hail in there as well. And temperature wise, it's going to be a rather cool day, even with the sunshine, even with the strong April sunshine, just nine or so degrees in the north and tens and elevens in the rainy areas in southern and eastern parts of the UK. Now that gradual process of drying out continues through Saturday night into Sunday. So again, under the clear skies, and especially so in the north, it will be another cold start. So again, we've gone from the heat of last weekend to the risk of frost in the north for the coming nights. So a chilly start on Sunday, but a bright start at least in the north. Fewer showers here. And indeed, it looks like a drier day for the most part further south. But you've still got quite a bit of cloud here. And again, there's a potential for more rain, strong winds to brew up later in the day. It only 10 or 11 degrees Celsius, recovering a little in Scotland and Northern Ireland, given some sunshine. But this is the reason for the cloud in the south later Sunday and the rain. Quite a deep area of low pressure for this time of year, bringing wet and windy and cold weather 